Good afternoon, we're so happy that you're here. We vlog every day, so if you like this video, we hope that you'll come back tomorrow. So I am just at home right now working and I wanted to show you guys the little lunch slash snack that I'm having. So this is a full tomato um, and then I mashed up a full avocado with Valentina and lime juice and onion powder and garlic. Just like a really quick guacamole, like a full guacamole, chunky guacamole. And there, the rest of it is going to be for our dinner tonight, but this way I could get a little bit more full. Hey, see what he's got to say. So Peter just called to chit chat because he likes me. Um, I'm going to start back up working. I actually have some emails over there. Um, uh oh, Eve's going to bark. She had some tomatoes with me. I finished my little snack while talking to Peter. She's hungry for more. Um, so yeah, I have arsenic and all lace. <laughs> Not sure what I'm gonna do for a time lapse, but here you go. Look how sunny my apartment is when I come home. It's so gorgeous. Peter, we're working out contracts that cannot be put in the vlog. Katie just got a, a contract sent to her. She's an up-and-coming Nickelodeon star. No, but this has been something that's been like, what, a year in the making? More than a year, I think. I think this is the first day I ever met you. <laughs> yeah, for Sarah's it's, making it's cheeseless quesadillas. It's 6.09. I'm about to go on a run. My first one in like a week. I feel like this is a recipe for disaster. What? We just had the most delicious meal that you just prepped, but it was more like a feast. I'm about to go run in the heat for the first time in a week. Our dog. Is too adorable. She went up there by herself. <laughs> Stop modeling, you cutie. Sarah's gonna get her nails did and her eyebrows done, and I'm gonna go run, and we gotta go. I'm gonna do our shot for IVF though. Yeah. Shot, shot, shots. All right, Sarah just left to get all those things done. I'm about to try to leave and leave Eve without her freaking out with the new apartment. I'm gonna go on my first run at our new apartment, and I'm excited because I specifically wanna do this during the daylight so I can kind of get a way, the, a feel of the land and to see the neighborhoods. Going for five miles tonight, if I can. Um, we'll see. My Achilles gave me some weird feelings today and then my, the back of my knee that the Achilles was hurting on was giving me a weird feeling earlier. So I'm hoping for five, but anything I get done will be a win because I got to take care of my body. I got to listen to it. So let's do it. So we didn't really explain what we're doing tonight. We had every intention of going to Epcot, but just after how I felt last night after being in the park, we figured we'd rather go to the park tomorrow night and kind of like get ourselves ready and another day of rest today. So I am going to get my nails done and my eyebrows done now, which works out so that I don't have to like take time out of my work day, which is really helpful for me. And then we're going to pack tonight. I'm going to continue doing some work tonight. And then that way, while we're gone over the weekend, I won't feel as bad if I don't get my normal amount of work done. Where the heck am I? Okay. There's this massive lake and these kids playing in this fountain. This is called Lakeside. It's in Winter Park on, Or no, on Orlando Avenue. Okay, and I just checked the map. This is called Lake Killarney. I think people are fishing. Wow. Oh yeah. Not every day you run past the mural, Mr. Rogers. Wants to be my neighbor. There's Rollins Soccer Field. And now I'm gonna go down Park Ave. I mean, come on. Does this, this not look like it's straight out of London? It's gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful park I have. Golf course over here. That's where the houses get really fancy over there. I gotta say, gotta get reused to running in a city. I actually used to running in a city because I never did this much running in Chicago. And I have to get a new path down because I got stopped by a lot of trains and a lot of red lights. So my pace is slower, but it's a good thing. It's caused me to stay slow, which is good for my Achilles. Still getting in the miles. Just at a little bit of a slower speed than I first imagined. But just gorgeous, gorgeous. I can go jump in that if I want to right now. It's like 95 with humidity. Hey, good girl. Hi. So 
the intro of today. I actually recorded twice. Once was super blurry. I'm just gonna put the footage in here because it was super cute. One, two, three. Exact same time I just walked in the door. And I came in after her. I was telling Sarah how my I'll explain later briefly. But my we, my run was good. My Achilles feels fine right now. That's my good. knee feels fine. Um, but just a bunch of weird stuff happened. How do you like the neighborhood? Love the neighborhood. I absolutely loved it. But I have to like get used to running. I have to not even get used to I have to learn to run in a city. Because like I kept getting stopped by lights and I have to like learn to like if I hit a red just turn, I'll figure out a, I'll change my path because I said it like one light for a minute and a half, another light for like 30 seconds, and those add up. Like, yeah. my speed was like a 10-15, which is great considering I haven't run in five days, but it's been closer to like a 9-30. Fancy nails. So I couldn't get my eyebrows done because the salon closed at 7-30. Because they're caterpillars. They said, we can't deal with those. <laughs> no, so, um, so there's one next I'm to joking. the tailor, and so I'm probably going to go Tomorrow. there first. And then, or maybe pick up my dress. I don't know. I'm gonna do all that. So it's got before. busy chores tomorrow. With yeah, the car. that's it. That's it. Yeah. Because I did this today. That's I why think it's so nice. I must shower. Okay. Your nails look beautiful. Thank you. you I feel like, like I'm on vacation because, like, I used to. I really only get my nails done when we go on vacation. Put a comment down below if you think Sarah should get her nails done more often. Not because she needs to, but because like it makes her feel fresh. Fresh. Vacation life. You know, no big deal. Just. Going on a little walk with my doggy out throughout the neighborhood because that's what we can do now. She is loving life. Oh, smelled something. Wants to go back this way. She couldn't handle walking anymore, so she's just sitting by the street watching the cars zoom by. She's got to reacclimate to being in the city again, too. Hey. We had our message. We have not filmed in quite some time. I worked. You did the dishes. I filmed a little bit when I took you on a walk. I took you on a walk. And, oh, you did? Yeah, a little bit. Your shadow is so big. Do something cool with your arms. <laughs> That's actually really cool. Happy Halloween. Jack the Pumpkin King. Hey, first. She's so tired. Are you? Upset you got us as your humans. <laughs> the big lesson in life, baby, is never be scared of anyone or anything. Frank Sinatra. Yeah. Peter Peter always says that, that he's not scared of nobody. And Peter and me are like one person, so that's me too. I forgot I had this on my head. We have um lights in our fan. They're just not working. I gotta look at that. Yeah. Tomorrow, we have some Big fun day. stuff coming up. Huge day. Errands and fun and joy and rapture. After work, we're doing two different theme parks. Packing up. Sarah, Sarah packing, but finishing packing. Shoot, I'm all, I got a bunch of stuff on our bed. <laughs> and then, we wake up. Going go to Detroit. Canada. Canada. We got our passports out. Hold on. Passports one and two, ready to go. Let's take the bridge. No, no, we're, bridge. we need them to go to Canada. I know. Where the wedding is. All right, done. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. What? What? It's good to be home. Green almonds <laughs> before bed. Have a good night. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>